hello hello everyone hi welcome back to another video if you're new here hi welcome my name is deborah and i film lifestyle <clears throat> living alone diaries type content here on youtube and i'm super duper stoked to have you um watching today's video i do have a few a bunch of new subscribers not i think more than a few at this point so hi thank you for stopping by i'm so glad to have you be a part of the youtube family but yeah so today i'm filming another um work from home type video um my morning has actually been pretty good it's been productive i've gotten like so on mondays i work from home and i tend to start my day my work day like kind of early i think today i started around like seven so it's not really like nine nine to five um but like i started around seven today because there's just like a task that i try to like it takes a significant portion of my work day on mondays so like i want to usually try to get that knocked out um as soon as possible but today i actually got done pretty early with that so i'm feeling pretty good about that um just taking a quick little break i stripped um the covers off of my sofa just because it's been a while they were in dire need of a wash so stripped it off um i'm gonna have to wash it in batches though because they're quite heavy and my poor combo washer dryer machine can only can only do so much at once i'm gonna have to do i'm gonna have to wash them in batches but that's fine um yeah so today though obviously beyond work i have a lunch appointment like a lunch call with my bank just wanting to just kind of talk about some just kind of ha i have like something some things in the pipeline that i just wanted to talk to my bank about just kind of get the ball moving uh, when it comes to that i'm not in a place where i want to talk about it but i think it's like the next um i'm like figuring out how i want to progress my life in a way and so it's just doing things in that regard um on mondays i also typically volunteer um at a non-profit here in the city that usually goes from like five to seven so i'll have that today later later today after work um and yeah i have a few other things that i need to get done on my to-do list today that i can like kind of do in between when i have when i'm taking little breaks uh from work and such but yeah my morning is going pretty well so far i'm just gonna take off my glasses to avoid the glare the morning's going pretty well so far um i'm expecting an order from dhl and from amazon uh the order that i'm expecting from dhl is hair bundles that i got uh i bought i ordered last week um so i'm waiting on an order through dhl for that one and um I'm also waiting on an Amazon order. One of the things that I order from Amazon is already here, but I'm just waiting for the rest of the stuff to get here so I can just do a haul all together rather than separately. But yeah, so that's pretty much what we've got going on today. Um, I wanna, so I have this like tall plant. I have this um, silver fin philodendron. I don't even, I just think I want to get rid of it in its entirety so I think I might put it up on Facebook marketplace and try to sell it and see if anyone is willing to buy it um, but yeah I've had this plant and it was a little baby in the widow pot but I think the best thing for it is to just repot it but like I would need a pretty large pot, like a really large pot, and I just, I don't have the space for it right now, so I'm just going to have to part part with it. I'll be selling the moss, the moss sticks as well, but yeah, I'm going to put this up on Facebook Marketplace later today, so I'll take some photos, get that uploaded. I do have some cuttings from when I pruned it. I have like several cuttings in like three jars, so I will be able to... I will be able to um, repot it or pot them at some point if I'd like to do that, but yeah. I just thought I'd come and introduce the vlog, say hi to y'all, show my face a little bit or speak a little bit, but that's pretty much how my morning's going and yeah.
Hi y'all. So for some strange reason, I got super duper tired just before I finished work for the day. Um, and so now it's literally almost 5 p.m. And I swear to God, I could go to bed right this instant. So I ended up just like canceling my volunteer shift. I just emailed them, let them know I can't ever be able to make it. I'm, I'm like exhausted, y'all. I want nothing more than to climb into bed and just watch Disney Plus until I fall asleep. Like, where I was so full of energy and then I think it was the green tea. Sometimes when I have too much caffeine, it has the opposite effect and I'm just more tired. But anyway, the rest of my packages have arrived, so let's unbox and haul them together. So much stuff. Y'all, I feel like, I don't know, I kind of feel like, let's bring this down a little. Not like I've been spending a ton of money, but like there's just so many things that I'm needing, wanting to buy. Um, there are many aspects of my apartment that I just have not been enjoying and I've been wanting to change for the longest time, but I've been putting them, putting them off just because I wanted to save money, blah, blah, blah. And I've just sort of like decided and gotten into, into this mindset of like, girl, you're not poor. You're not rich either yet. But like, I think I, I've just had this mindset of, oh, I can't spend money because just not because I don't have the money, but because I'm scared of like, oh, what if I spend it and then something happens? And honestly, this is like a childhood trauma response of growing up and not having a lot. And so I feel like I need to always save for a rainy day, which is not a bad, like wanting to save or getting into the habit of saving for a rainy day is not at all a bad habit. It's this, it's this, it's, it becomes dysfunctional when you just want to funnel away, scroll away every cent and you can't spend on things you want to spend on things that will improve your quality of life whether marginally or like more than marginally. But anyway, forget that spiel. I just wanted to go on that spiel. Um, so the first thing that I have here is from Amazon. Um, I don't know what it is with Amazon. They need to find like smaller packages because literally the thing, this is, this is what I ordered, this this why does it have to come in a, a package that is three times its size in width like what the heck um so the first thing i got here are these like triangular makeup makeup sponges and this is just really for like my other eye area um, I've been wanting something like this for a while. I was checking out like the Sephora brand one, but they were sold out. So I just decided to get this off of Amazon. And good thing I did. It was like $5 for two. I said, let's. Why the eck not? So pick that up. And then the next thing that I also got, which is related to like the home aspect is bedding so right now i'm cycling between two bed sheets i said i'm not even joking two bed sheets but like it's just though they're looking raggedy so i decided that i was gonna upgrade and get a different like a new bed set bed spread set so i got this i wanted like a sage green and now that i'm looking at it i don't know it's it's giving me hospital vibes i don't know like what do you what do y'all think of this color? I thought it would be more sagey. Uh, I don't know. I guess I might feel better about it maybe when it's styled on my bed with other things, but <laughs> I'm so tired. <laughs> Anyway, I picked this up. I don't know how I feel about it That's just yet. I'm not thrilled about it. I think I just expected like a different color maybe. Is this what sage looks like? It is a light green, but like, it's just giving me, it's not the energy I want. Um, the other thing that I picked up is, ah, 
new pots. Huh. Hmm. So I feel like this portion, entire this portion of this video is probably sounding a lot like complaints, but hear me out. So when I first moved into this apartment, almost two years ago now, um, I was like, I just wanted to get everything set up. And so I made some hasty purchases, you know? And included in those hasty purchases was my pot set. Um, I saw a pot set on Amazon, I thought it was a good price. I'm pretty sure I ended up with this current pot set that I have because the one I really wanted was sold out. Anyway, and this one was affordable. But like, y'all, I hate this pot set. I hate that my current pot set so much. First of all, the orange color is just so ugly. And it's it hasn't held up well to use over time. It's not non-stick anymore, at least for the frying pans. And one of the lids broke, like the glass, it broke. So now I have incomplete lids. And so it's been on my list of things I've wanted to switch out for a long time and just get replacement, but I just haven't gotten to it. And so finally, I bit the bullet and got um, a new set of pots. And this one is by the brand Carrot. Carrot. And this is just from this is just from Amazon um, as well. So the cool thing about this pot set is that the handles are detachable. So they're great for like, so you can stack them and they're just great for space saving, right? Um, and so that's like one of the things that attracted me to this set. So this is, um, man, how many set pieces is this? I think I want to say this is 11 pieces and honestly, I think I have more items here um, in my current, like this has more pieces than my current set. And so the cool thing about this is that the handles are detachable. It comes with two detachable handles. It can just like attach to, you know, the pan. And so it's really cool and nifty because it's just like a great um, space saving, space saving hack. And I live in a small apartment. I don't have a lot of like cupboard space in my kitchen. So this is pretty cool. Um, I'm super, super excited to use this. So I got it in like this kind of cool, like this color is just so pretty y'all like compared to what i've been going through with that orange rubbish um so yeah i'm super stoked about this y'all i'm so excited um and the final thing that i've got is from dhl so i got three bundles of peruvian hair from selly hair i picked up 22 24 and 26 inches um, I don't think I've ever had 26 inch hair before. Um, but this is pretty affordable. So what it looks like, I'm gonna pop it open here. This is what the bundle looks like. Um, it's kind of nice and soft. I picked up, this is a body wave, I'm pretty sure. Or a loose wave, deep wave? I think it's a loose wave. But yeah, this is what it looks like. Um, but yeah, so those are all the things that I picked up. I will tr try to remember to leave links in the description box. Yo, I'm so bad at leaving links. I just always forget. I just, I just, no word of a lie. I just forget to do it, but I will do better, okay? So that's everything that I've got. Um, I'm gonna put all these things away, clean up around the apartment, and honestly just hop into bed, like just start my evening routine. I'm gonna journal, and then I'm gonna read, and then if I have energy, I'll eat. I need to pack my lunch for tomorrow. Why is, why is life so hard, you know? I, I just wish I had someone to do all these things for me. I don't wanna be an adult anymore. <laughs> Oh, but yeah.
Thank you.